Once upon a time in a cozy little kitchen, a diabolically delicious plot was hatched to create the most devilishly delightful deviled eggs the world has ever seen. First, we'll need to round up a half dozen large eggs. The fresher, the better, my friends. Place these eggy orbs in a saucepan and cover them with water. Crank up the heat, and when that water starts boiling, it's time to play a little game of hide and seek. Remove the pan from the heat, cover it up, and let those eggs stay hidden for 10 to 12 minutes. Now let's cool things down. Using a slotted spoon, carefully transfer the eggs from the saucepan to a bowl filled with ice cold water and a few ice cubes. This will stop the cooking process and make peeling a breeze. Let the eggs chill out in the ice bath for about 5 minutes. Peel those babies and slice them lengthwise, revealing their sunny yellow centers. Now here's where the real magic happens. It's time to add the star ingredients. Mayonnaise for that creamy richness, a touch of Dijon mustard for a zingy kick, and a splash of white vinegar to really make those flavors pop. Season with salt and pepper to taste, and stir until everything's combined into a velvety smooth mixture. For an extra velvety texture, you can optionally pass the yolk mixture through a fine mesh sieve. This will ensure a super creamy and smooth filling that'll have your deviled eggs irresistibly luxurious. It's optional, but trust me, it's worth it. But we're not done yet, oh no, to give our deviled eggs that irresistible jaw-dropping presentation, we're going to pipe that luscious filling into the egg white halves. Grab a piping bag, fit it with a large star tip, or if you're feeling a little sassy, you can use a plastic sandwich bag and snip off a corner. Either way, hold that bag over each egg white and pipe that dreamy filling in a swirly rosette pattern that would make a French pastry chef swoon. Once you've filled all those egg white cups with the sinful yolk mixture, it's time to add a little devilish flair. Sprinkle some paprika over the top for a pop of color and a hint of smoky flavor. And if you're feeling extra fancy, garnish those beauties with some chopped fresh chives or parsley for a touch of green. Now here's the hardest part, you'll need to chill those deviled eggs in the fridge for at least 30 minutes before serving. I know, I know, it's torture to wait, but trust me, it'll be worth it when you sink your teeth into these little bites of heaven. And remember folks, if you want the full written recipe, head on over to kelvinskitchen.com. But for now, let's give it up for these devilishly delicious deviled eggs.